As you can see. Ah, okay. okay. Where is it? <laughs> is it there? Yes. Okay. You get the link. Bogu pine shirt. It's with fufu. We are going to enjoy it. Oh. It's too sweet and then you don't even know what to say again. So guys, try this. Don't forget to subscribe and then like and comment and then suggestion and everything. Hello lovely family, welcome back to Eagle Eyes Angle channel. If today is your first time, we say aquaba to you. But if you are a member, we say thank you, we love you. In today's video, we are going to prepare copper pine or apese meat with palmnol soup. So guys, please take your seat and watch out. But in all, give thanks to my auntie. She's the one who will be doing everything for me. I love it. Let's go on. Let's take a look at my ingredients and then start cooking. Little pepper, garlic, tomatoes, and we have sea salt. And of course, we have ginger and governor. And we also have onions and okra in the building and of course we have the star of the day which is palm nuts and of course also on the table we have berry fruits and also we have scent leaf water leaf and our poco pan mates i may not be getting this pronunciation correct from time to time but pardon me okay all right so let's start the cooking proper Please do it to like and share this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed to our channel. Victoria and every other person you have been seeing in the video, the entire team is saying a very big thank you to all of you that are newly subscribed to our channel. And of course, to those of you that keep coming back to watch our videos, please help us to like these videos, okay? Very important. So this is what we are starting out with. We are going to put our palm nut on fire and keep it boiling because it takes time for it to cook. So with that going on on fire, Victoria is, you know, going on ahead with her um, shopping of vegetables. She does this before blending. And today she said in this video, she's going to use the local way of blending so that those that do not have a blender, can um get to see that how she do it without a blender so the palm nut is on fire then she went on with the scent leaf properly washed you can see then added it and the berry fruits or nuts added everything together with pepper i was very surprised because i didn't know that this is how palm nut soup is made and then with this she's just gonna go on and cover that up while we go back to the other side of things Okay, so our palm nut um, is ready for pounding. This is what we do. We're just gonna pour this out, sieve it like this. Please be careful. This contains pepper. Just as you can see, everything that I showed you guys earlier while it was boiling is what you're seeing here. The berry nuts or berry fruits and um, the scent leaf, pepper, and of course, palm nuts. 
everything is combined in one place so this is how to do it just pound it carefully hit it hit it hit it until it is smooth that way you're gonna get the oil out without stress the best way to do it don't leave it to be too cold before you pound okay it's actually fun to pound it while it's hot or warm that way it gets to heat i mean you get to get the oil easily out of it like you get to extract whatever you want from it easily and faster than leaving it to cool so just heat it like so okay and then we are going back to the other side of things to prepare our poco pan meat victoria does not use seasoning cube for her soups or stew she does this with just uh, sea salt and the local spices and she uses onions she does not encourage the use of food sweetener in our dishes in our meals she does not encourage it so we just put that together and place it on fire for it to boil and then we go back to the palm nut on how to extract it now after pounding for some time this is what we get mind you there's pepper there but victoria is an expert in this so she knows how to do these things easily please do not forget to encourage her by liking this video okay she is so good at this thing so please like the video it's gonna encourage her leave her a nice comment down there in the comment section and don't forget to share the video as you go so now victoria is gonna add some water she added warm and cold water okay this is very good for the whole thing because after pounding for some time it becomes cold and the oil slips so it won't let you sieve it won't let you extract easily if you don't use warm water to encourage the oil to be extracted easily so that is exactly what she did and now we got what we want from it this um we just put everything in this and sieve it like so for it to be smooth so all the particles or the whatever we don't need we set it aside and extract only what we need this is one of the healthiest things in africa trust me i know what i'm saying so she's gonna do all of this and then we went back to check our meat which was boiling and this is what we get so what victoria did here is she allowed the meat to continue boiling okay she does her cooking with lots of patience and then while we were on it the rain came so we had to move from outside to the veranda so in case there's a switch in the video and you are wondering what happened so it was because the rain came so we have a veranda so we moved everything there this is africa for you welcome to africa by the ways so already extracted oil the palm oil so we had that boil separately and we have the meat you know taken down first because it's already cooked at this point so we're gonna let this be there for a very long time all right i'm not about to console you that this is fast 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 this is going to boil until the oil surface on the surface all right once it starts to bring out the oil you know that it is ready and it's time to mix it up with your beef your proteins so it's either you pour the protein into the pot of the the palm palm nut or you pour the protein into the pot of the boiling protein so i mean you put the palm nut into the protein so it's all the same okay whichever way you choose to do it but if i were you i would do exactly like victoria because it came out really amazing and i can't wait to show you what you will get later later in the video so mix everything together like so make sure you see how she takes her time do this carefully so it doesn't it does not splash on you or splash on things around carefully mix everything together do not add seasoning cube thank you very much okay she covered that up and then we open it again we can see now it has the oil on the surface what we are adding now is called water leaf so we're adding that you can actually use um, spinach if you want but we are using water leaf of course because we have it just at the back of the house there are a lot of it so we're going on with that stir 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 everything together 
and again leave it to boil okay you can see we added okra and uh, pepper just in case you like it hot we got you covered so already we went to the farm behind to get our plantain and cassava next time we're going to show you this part okay but today just take this and be okay with it so we are going to make fufu with this all right because we we have some visitors come over so we're going to make this to be a lot and victoria intend to send food to someone close to her there's an elderly woman behind the house so victoria said okay today we are sending food so we made all of this having the old lady and our guest in mind all right so this is what you do when you are making fufu okay for those of you that likes to eat the Ghanaian food and you're not Ghanaian or you've never been here you're curious just take a look at Victoria she separated a plantain on ripe plantain please make sure the plantain is not ripe at all okay this is going to help you get what you're looking for she peels it with her hands bare hands instead of using the knife to cut it I wanted to know why so she said it's because when you are doing this with your bare hand when you're cooking it it does not retain water it will just cook and still be dry at the same time she knows what she's talking about and at the end of the day it was just so nice the fufu was smooth soft and very uh interesting you know to eat so follow every single thing that you see seen here in this video okay to achieve the best of everything that victoria is showing you so our fufu our cassava and plantain is ready and we are gonna do this digga digga the african way you know so if you have a food processor which i highly recommend okay you can do this but here in the village people rather use um their mortar to pound some people actually believe that the one pounded or mortar is the best okay for me i think fufu is fufu but in case you want to do it the african way which you should this is how to do it okay be careful so pound this smoothly you pound we already pounded the plantain so we set it aside now we are pounding the cassava and then we are going to have everything mixed together and get to get that smooth fufu spaced all right don't joke this is very 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 interesting to watch so you already see we have two colors here we have the yellow and the white the yellow is the plantain and the white is the cassava so let's do the combination now let's combine everything together and get it to man rate oh ooh, la la so this is how the process is being achieved okay so you hit that you hit that you continue to pound 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 and now our fufu is a year ready all right so at this point victoria deserves a nice thumbs up hey. is it working? this one you want to give it to someone no, what, who is this for okay you have an old lady neighbor here mm. that's so nice of you now my palm nut soup is ready i'm serving it with fufu we are going to enjoy it oh it's too sweet and then you don't even know what to say again so guys try this don't forget to subscribe and then like and comment and then suggestion and everything Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My little guy is happy. Oh. Thank you.
Isa is always the first. Authentic, <laughs> delicious, palm nuts with porcupine meat. Porcupine <laughs> wolves. Hey, you are wearing porcupine shirt. As you can see. Ah, okay. okay. Where is it? <laughs> is it there? Yes. Okay. You get the link. Porcupine shirt. Can we start? Yeah, please. We have. We started since soon. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> And this one, we know the edit time. We a poster like that. Oh, mm -hmm. This part. <laughs> oh, truly, that's what you're wearing. Yeah. 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 Hey, let's see. You see the, the badge over here? It's called Kumasa Santi But then, when it comes to English, we call it the porcupine warriors. Porcupine warriors. And we are, <laughs> and you are eating? We are eating porcupine meat with fufu. <laughs> I swear, today, <laughs> everything mm. match. Yeah. Ha! Hey. Um. Porcupine. This one is called fufu. Mm. The ingredients are so simple. They are just a pure combination of two brothers. <laughs> the first one is called plantain, and the second one is cassava. Simple. <laughs> ah. Hey, Annie, I'm coming to <laughs> take. Who we'll eat and leave you? Mm. Mm -hmm. Eat, okay? Around you. I beg, Mr. Pokupan, let me mm -hmm. eat some of the fufu. Chef small make her eat the fufu. Mm. Fufu pie. Ha! The food alone. Ha! Please don't forget to subscribe, like. Mm. Mm. Please. We just want you to do just three things for us. The first one is you. You like the channel. The second one, you share it. And the third one, you subscribe to it. So that any video we... We, 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 we post. <laughs> any video we post, you'll be the first person to have a share of it. Thank you. Thank you too. Simple. No, we we like Ego Eye Angle TV. So we everybody like will you say subscribe, we want like to go. Subscription. Subscribe. Want to go. Subscribe. Subscribe! Honey, are you eating with us? Hey! Mm -hmm. I've been quite there. Subscribe, Ego, I, Ango TV. So that uh, the next one, you prepare Eba with elephant egg. <laughs> now you know. Eba with elephant egg. Yeah. Love you.